What is up, YouTube? It is your friend Kyle, and we are back on the main squad playing ranked seasons, trying to get to World Series while debuting some of these dope ass cards that have come out recently. They have released some crazy, crazy studs in the last few days. And as you guys know, we try to hop on it as soon as possible. And that's why all my damn stubs go down the drain because I pay top notch as soon as they come out and try to play with them. And then I sell them seconds later for thousands but you know what we're not even gonna go into that all right i'm gonna get sad what we are doing today is we are debuting somebody that a lot of the community and myself has been looking forward to coming out all year this is a card that always rakes even if it's his gold card even when he was a live series diamond he is always raked so it's definitely good to have this card in this game now 2016 mvp chris bryant now i know i got a lot of cubs fans that are friends and a lot of cubs fans that are followers so i know a lot of you guys are looking forward to using this card and besides chris bryant he's a likable dude he's handsome we all like him all right so there's no there's no haters here we should all be happy about this card he hits against righties just fine 96 contact versus righties 95 power versus righties and he has 106 contact versus lefties and 120 power versus lefties that's some big loop power versus lefties we we're gonna want to see that he's got 71 vision which doesn't matter with this new pci change 95 discipline hopefully that could help me with my check swings a little bit and he's got good fielding he's a gold fielder no matter where you put him unless you're gonna throw him at catcher and be weird but any of his secondary positions he is a gold fielder so that's good and 74 speed is serviceable so definitely a good card attribute wise we're just curious how his swing and his stands are when it comes to the legend pitching which we're not going to face because we're not in world series yet so we're going to see how he does as always when i have these righty guys that i'm debuting with i usually put them in the two spot behind mickey mantle so we'll have mickey mantle chris bryant eric thames Gary Sheffield, Chipper Jones, Larry Walker, Ryan Sandberg, and my cap's name is Yachty is better than Posey because it was a, uh, a bet that we lost. We're not going to talk about that. You guys are going to ignore that. We got Biggio on the bench now. He's been demoted because he's had a really small wiener lately. Carlos Correa, Harmon Killebrew, Nolan Gorman, Christian Yelich. For this game, I think we'll probably start carry. And then if we need to, we'll go to outlighter. As always, make sure to leave a thumbs up on this video and subscribe if you guys do enjoy the content. Leave a comment below and let me know which of the stage three cards or any of the new cards you guys wanna see me debut. We're working towards getting World Series, hopefully getting a uh, Vladimir Guerrero debut or a Eddie Matthews debut for you guys soon. But let me know who you guys wanna see the most, all right? We're going to be facing Kluber, I can tell you right now. Let's see how smart I am. We're facing Kluber. We're facing Kluber. We're facing Kluber. Okay. His name is Please Don't Touch My Rav. And he's got Tony Gwynn batting leadoff. And David Fletcher is cat. And he has Matt Wieters. We better not lose this game. All right. Full tryhard. Come on. And we got Eric Thames in the lineup now. Okay, let's see what we can do. He's got Tony Gwynn, and he's batting infinity with him. Oh, my God. He's batting 536 with him. That does not seem uh, good for us to face. So we're going to try to beat him. That's a good pitch. That's how you start it off, baby. That's how you start it off. Let's go. Okay. Good contact, but it's okay. It's okay. Two outs. We're fine. David Ortiz hit three home runs off us last game we faced him, so we're just going to try to improve that by only giving up two or less this game. I just can't get him out. That's the only issue. I cannot get David Ortiz out in any situation in any game. Dot? You know, it's just crazy. I wonder if I'll ever be able to get David Ortiz out in any game ever. Like, just any game, no matter who, even against the computer. Wow, we have to get lucky. Chris Bryant's at third, of course, is going to make that play. Let's see how he hits. We know he can field. Let's see how he hits. Okay, it's it's not going to be a late day. It's just going to be a bad day. It's just going to be a horrible day. Okay. As long as I know it. As long as I know it. As long as I don't have my hopes up, we'll be all right. Okay, now Chris Bryant's up in his debut, his first at-bat versus Oral. We'll see what he can do. Hopefully we don't get dotted off too much. We don't want him to dot our penis off. We just want to just get nice pitches to swing at, take a nice clean cut and do our thing. Chrissy? Chrissy? Let's go. That's going to be a triple. 
That's gonna be a triple, and he earned it. It's it's not Mickey Mantle's fault. It's not our opponent's fault. We earned that triple. Let's go, Chris. He's already on cycle watch, boys. He's already on cycle watch. I'm screwed. I'm screwed. And Chris is not gonna score, is he? I just took the earliest jump ever known to mankind. Yeah, a little too early. A little too early. He didn't even tag. Okay. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Good job, Kyle. Yeah, this guy's gonna kick our arse. This guy's gonna kick our arse. I could tell. If I'm making good pitches and I cannot hit the ball to save my life, we're in trouble, Bubble. Yep, we're 10 and 3 on this season so far. 10 and 3 on this season. Not a bad start. Okay. This guy, like, I understand that's an out and I should be happy, but I don't know if he's had a bad swing yet, so I'm not happy. I'm scared. Dot. Dog, like, I'm literally gonna lose to this guy. I've never been so intimidating. Um, sir? Oh my god. I'm facing god. I'm gonna lose this game. I can tell. I can tell. There's no other way to put it. My man has not had one at bat where I'm like, oh, I got this dude. Not sure who he is. Somebody check a record. But he's the best ever. I lost. Like, what What am I playing? What am I playing right now? Are you kidding? I feel like crying. For a second, I was like, they actually let me hit that out. And then I realized that it wasn't out. And then I wanted to cry. Yes, Quash. We take this loss off the chin. And then we play somebody else. And we try to win. But we're going to play a full nine innings this game. Unless he mercies us. And we're just gonna get warmed up, you know? It's We just gotta get warmed up. Oh my god. Okay. Two outs? This is not a drill. We can get three outs right here. Ah, never mind. Alright, four nothing. Four nothing. Four nothing. Alright, four nothing, but there's there's two outs still. We're facing the number four batter. All right, two nothing. He hit a home run on an 0-2 count, which is very unfortunate. We did not want to give up a home run there, but um, oh, let's go baby. Reverse psychology at its finest, boys. That's how we play the game. Am I gonna take bad swings all game or just like just the first six innings? Just asking for a friend. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I just gotta, I gotta get locked in, but I could tell that this dude's locked in when he's hitting. Jesus Lord. I'm about to give this guy full access to my YouTube channel and my Twitch channel, and I'm gonna just let him play my games from now on. This man needs to be known. You know what? I'm going to take an executive decision right now. Carrie is not good on Hall of Fame, boys. We got to jam people on Hall of Fame. We got to put people in situations to make bad swings. No more Carrie Wood. Can we not put that there? I mean, thank the Lord that we fluked him. There's only one out. I thought that was a second out. We are just in bad situations all the time. We love the line outs to short. We love them. Okay, we got out of it again. Maybe I was giving him a little too much credit in the beginning, a little bit, but if we lose, we lose, right? If we lose, then I didn't give him too much credit. We have that needs to be the start of something, boys. It has to be. All right, KB. Let's do it, Papa. I'm going to try to get him in a scoring position for you, man. <laughs> We need something good. There we go. That's one hell of a steal. We got the jump of a lifetime there. All right, KB. Let's go. It's your time. It's your time. You got a triple already. Do the damn job. 
Oh my gosh. We actually freaking hit that ball. That was a dot too. Chris Bryant starting off the game right. He's on cycle watch, boys. A single and a triple. boy, Chris. Good pitch, man. God. I do not feel comfortable against Oro right now, man. I feel gross against him right now. Like, my, it's something with, uh, I wish I could just hit diagnosis and know what's wrong in my head. Like, like why I'm in uncomfortable in a certain situation. I don't know why it is against him right now. Like, I was raking oral all day yesterday, so I don't know why right now it feels weird. It's not like I went from all-star to legend or hall of fame to legend. We are still on all-star. Everything's the same. My everything's the same. Maybe I need water or something. That was a check swing. I w I tapped that really softly, but oh well. We got one. The pitch speeds of Oral with like a uh, with the like Hall of Fame speed and stuff. I think it just maybe makes it awkward. I just realized that he, it was just that three run homer that he hit and I was just like so scared. But in reality, we've been pitching pretty well besides that. Like we haven't given up a run besides that. So I just got to keep doing that. Okay, good hit. Wow. Wow, rare. All right, at least we're home, man. But God, we got to score some runs, my dude. See, I keep on swinging when I'm not supposed to. I took first pitch, I was gonna take second one, and I just swung for no reason. Like, I'm not I'm not ready to swing at a pitch, but I still swung at that. So dumb. Literally just had to take all those, man. Come on, Yachty, please, do something once. Dog, I keep on swinging so, like that, that thing's, I'm just not seeing that high sinker. He should throw that every time, bro. I'm telling you. Because right now, I am not seeing anything with that sinker. I'm glad that sinker can be right there, right. Oh my God, out boy, Chapman. Jesus, how did he cover there? Jesus Christ, dude. Chris Bryant has a triple and a single. We need a home run, baby. Oh my God, dude. It it feels like I'm on legend. When I'm trying to swing and hit that sinker, it feels like I'm on legend. And I'm not kidding. It. I'm so late on that pitch. Eric Thames. Thank you, God. We needed one eventually. Come on. We need more good swings than that, though. Yeah, I don't know, man. We're going to have to get used to that sinker eventually because I, I don't know what's happening right now. But that sinker is different right now. That sinker feels different. Come on. Little fluky song. Who we weren't on that one? Oh my god, I'm so ass, bro. He's just better. He's just better than your average Joe. And we gotta we gotta cancel it out. What? Dog. I mean Look where that pitch was. <laughs> oh my god. He was late on that too. Wait, right? That means he was late on that, right? Like on the later side of the good side? I'm surprised he hit that f***ing out. Later side of good on an inside sinker and he pulled it for a no doubter. Like it wasn't, it wasn't even close to getting him out. It literally was a no doubter. That's how I thought the other Daniel Murphy one was gonna be. 
All right, we have three innings. Let's get two runs. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, I thought they were gonna fluke me. He took a whole, like his computer took a horrible animation on that, but he gunned it right after. I am not doing well, brother. I am hitting poorly. I'm pitching. I'm not pitching that bad, but I'm hitting poorly and I'm throwing dots and this guy's smacking the out of him. And that's going to be a double with two outs. Oh, unless I hit a home run, that's going to be very sad boy. That's sad boy right there. Mickey. He's going to catch that. I can't get that card out, dude. It's just so irritating. I'm ready to shake this one off and just play another one after some BP. He's out. He's out. All right, we got to get two runs, man. We got to get two runs. I wish I got to check what this dude's record is after this. Oh, God. I mean, does that have to be that much of a pop-up in the infield? Can that at least be a fly-out or something? Please? Or a hard hit ground ball to the second baseman, and we have one inning left to score two rounds. There's some games that just feel weird when you're playing. That just feel like... It just feels tough to get into. Not mentally, but if like it feels like... You're just stuck in the mud. In one of these games, it feels like I'm stuck in the mud. When I'm making good pitches, the the home runs, and then when I'm trying to put good at-bats together, I just can't because I'm making bad swings. I'm just keeping myself stuck in the mud, and I need to find a way to miraculously get out of it in the ninth. But I just don't see how it's going to happen. I cannot stand when I feel like this. My man has not made, <laughs> if he's made a bad swing, I don't know when it was. I don't know when it was because the fact that I've only given up six runs to him and two of the runs were on that Daniel Murphy home run makes me feel proud of myself. If I was just having a regular hitting game like I've been having the whole season, we would have won this game pretty easily, but I chose a bad game to choke, man. I chose a bad game to let my bats die. Like, what the f man? It's just so crazy. I It feels like I'm playing somebody that's not actually like a human. The pitches that I'm throwing, they aren't bad pitches. There's nothing else I can do besides tip my hat. Just good swings. Swings that people don't put up against people usually. <sighs> oh my god, bro. The guy's throwing 117 pitches. Like, oh my god. <laughs> GG's, man. GG's. Well played to him. He pitched well. He hit well. Did everything well. Flawlessly, actually. And that's just how that happens sometimes. Some games are tough. I appreciate you guys watching. Chris Bryant, he did all right in his debut. Had an RBI, had a triple, had a single, but we didn't get the job done. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.